what's up you dudes this is Godson and welcome back to my top five countdowns if you guys are familiar with this this is where you send in your clips to me and I review it and I pick the top five people that have made the best raids so far in the game so check it out dudes we have a lot gonna happen today a lot of submissions a lot of really good loot uh, but this is the area this is my honorable mentions where I give you guys shout outs for sending in your clips however you didn't make it to the top five but still a good attempt keep sending in your clips keep sending in your raids and keep hustling for that loot you dudes so let's go ahead and get right into this I'm gonna pick the top five so you guys sit back relax we're gonna watch these pros go in and take this loot it's never fun to lose that much but it's always fun to see people gain it so here we go all right dudes coming in at number five it is due this guy made it to my top five because he's using the uh, very famous Garcha strategy. Uh, giants and archers with wizards in the back. Now these aren't max troops, so he's gonna have a hard time going against this Town Hall 9, but check it out, he's got 856,000 on the line here in terms of gold that he's gonna try and get. And as you can see, the giants are working their way around. This base is designed so that all of the mortars are targeting these giants. He just doesn't have any firepower up there to stop them and the archers of course come in from behind and clean it up the giant survived the whole thing dudes and that's 850,000 in hurt that this guy just lost so good stuff dude all right coming in at number four it's Lou Dangerous from Porito so this guy came up uh, with 800,000 each for gold and elixir, but look at the army composition he's using against a Town Hall 10. This is my Lavalunian attack that I love so much. Um, it is a stronger attack, of course. This is one of the strongest air attacks that you could do in the game, but it very much, it really paid off for him. He was able to get in there with those balloons and survive the whole thing, you guys. That is a lot of loot to find from just searching the bases, but... It probably is a dead base, but it, either way, he lost all that loot, so good stuff, Loot Dangerous. All right, now coming in at number three, it is Jinx from Friendhood, and this guy found a one million base. One million gold base that he found with a Town Hall 10 loot is everywhere you can see that a lot of dead people a lot of dead bodies on the outside trying to get in and take that loot um i can't really say that the design is bad it just didn't work for him or maybe the uh, jinx just had a really good comp it's a farming comp so giants in the front archers and wizards in the back this guy's definitely taking all that loot that is a lot my goodness so good stuff jinx making it on the number three spot All right, coming in at number two, I don't even know how to say his name, but he's from, it looks like, the clan MC5 Champions, if I got that correct. Uh, and he's using an old dragon attack. This is insane because I never see these greedy dragons in the game like this with so much loot on the line here. But this is a Town Hall 8, so I mean, it, it, maybe it is a little overpowered. You can say that. But dang, that is uh, a lot of loot. This poor Town Hall 8, he should have logged in and spent it before this guy came in and took it out. That's like Christmas money right there. Holy moly. So good stuff. With all Dragon Team, those dragons are super greedy and they're taking every last coin. You guys, that is making it on the number two spot. Good stuff. All right, you guys, you know the deal. We're gonna check out the number one spot and we're gonna try and give this guy a moment of silence. Okay, good enough. His name is Crucify and he's from Request and Go Clan. Now check this out. He's using a Lava Lunion attack with some bombers. Oh, I know what it is. The bombers help the heroes get in uh, because heroes have a hard time breaking walls, especially the king. He's got a butter knife and it doesn't really work well against walls, especially the queen too. She has a hard time getting in, but as you can see, all the troops are out there. These guys just massacred that base. And this is definitely the highest amount that we've seen so far uh, this month in my top so top five series. You guys, that is a lot of loot. I don't even know if he can get it all, but <laughs> he's trying. Oh, he's trying. Yeah, 40 seconds left. Can he get it all? I think he can. Yeah, there's no more weapons in the way. Wow, that is it. 
definitely a three star um almost a million each you guys super clutch super cool well i don't think he'll three star but he got all that loot there it is all the weapons see never put your weapons on the outside like that but you guys that is my number one spot if you want to join this and submit your stuff check the link in the description and send it in to me and i will judge it for the top five thank you guys for watching this is godson and i will see you next time godson out